Hey you guys, it's Peter and welcome to my channel. Peter! <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Review stuff. And yes, I am back for another Starbucks review. I'm really excited. If you watched my video yesterday, um, you will know that Starbucks just put out two new drinks uh, for March. These are their new spring drinks, I guess. Did you see I just got my hair cut? Yesterday I thought I was getting my hair cut, but I actually got my hair cut today. So I probably got hairs and all kinds of stuff all over my shirt. Don't even don't even worry about it. Okay, I'm my own person. Don't even worry about it. But um, yeah. So Starbucks put out two new drinks, and um, so let me uh get to the drinks here. Hold on a second. Where is it at? I thought this was the article, but this is the wrong article. Okay, hold on a second. Um, I was reading this from the Thrillist. Here it is. Starbucks just added two all new drinks for spring. I read part of this article yesterday. Starbucks loves giving us new drinks, and thankfully, we love trying them, it says. And I read a lot of this yesterday. The drink that I will be trying today, hold on a second, let me get to it. Here are the new drinks you'll be ordering on repeat this season. And the first one is uh, the Iced Brown Sugar Oat Milk Shaken Espresso. Blonde espresso is shaken with brown sugar and cinnamon, then topped off with oat milk and ice. And I reviewed this yesterday. I gave it five out of five stars. I thought it was really, really good. I actually went to bed last night at like nine o'clock and woke up at um, like five o'clock this morning to go vlog. And... Um, while I was vlogging, I went through Starbucks and I was like, I'm going to get that drink again because I really, really liked it. So it's, I haven't finished it actually, but it's right here. This is how much I drank from this morning. So I would uh, highly, highly, highly recommend the uh, brown, the iced brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso. Okay. So the one that I am going to try today is the iced chocolate almond milk shaken espresso. And it is a blonde espresso. Oh, it says blonde espresso is shaken with cocoa and notes of malt, then topped with almond almond milk and ice and it goes on here and explains it and I talked about this yesterday so anyway that's the drink that I'm gonna try today have you guys tried it already what do you think about it I'm really excited to try it I will tell you that let me fix my hair for a second uh, okay it's got a lot of product in it right now but anyway um, when I went through a couple days ago, be, like this was the day that they came out, which I guess would have been <clears throat> Monday, and I didn't know that. I went inside because I was looking for the new anniversary cups, and I talked to Josh, and Josh said he doesn't like the one that I'm reviewing today. And then I talked to Jacob yesterday, and his fiance, and Jacob said he didn't like the one that I'm reviewing today. So I am going to get my regular coffee just in case, um, my pretty cup. No, I didn't get any of the anniversary cups. Yes, I'm very upset about it, but I'm going to, well, I got the plastic $3 cheapie, you know, um, cause I wanted to get something from the anniversary collection, but apparently they have a bunch of these new cups and I didn't get any of these. I might go to Target right now and see if they have any, but anyway, um, yeah. So I'm, uh, going to go, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to go through here and see if I like it cause um, that's what I do. Because this is a review channel, if you didn't know. That's why it's called Peter Review Stuff, <laughs> in case you didn't know. In case you're new to this channel, this is a review channel. That's why it says Peter Review Stuff in the title of the channel. But anyway, I know that's probably confusing. You guys are like, well, you review stuff? Is that why? Yes, that's why it's called Review Stuff. <laughs> Peter. And I'm Peter, and I'm the one that reviews stuff. And stuff is usually Starbucks drinks. Or, or Dunkin' Donuts drinks sometimes. Or other kinds of food, usually. But anyway, we're going to try this, and I need my coffee, because I haven't had any coffee today. Well, the coffee I had earlier, but then I came home and I went back to bed because I was so tired. I was so tired. So anyway, I'm excited about this. Y'all ready? Y'all ready for this? Bum, bum, bum. Do you remember how they always play that at, like, sporting Welcome events? Starbucks. What can I get for you? Um, could I please get a grande chocolate almond milk shake and espresso? Yes. Are you going to get your venti iced Americano today? Too? Yes, your, venti one. Venti iced Americano blonde. With the extra shot. With the extra shot and a splenda. Sorry, Jake yep. was talking to me. So, the um, the chocolate almond milk espresso, shaken espresso, that's a grande, right? Correct. All right, anything else for you? Nope, that's it. All righty, see you at the window. All right, minutes. thank you. So the drink is 110 calories and it is $5.45, which is, let's just be for real, that's astronomical, isn't it? I mean, like that is an expensive drink, but do it for the review. Do it for the review. Ooh, the straps to this are wet because I wore, hey, Veronica. 
How are you? Do you know the song I'm singing to you? No. <laughs> it's I might, but I it's might. an Elvis Costello song and it's called Veronica. Oh, you know what? And that's, that's funny because my mom is an Elvis fan, but she never played that for me. Not Elvis, Elvis. Elvis Costello. Is Elvis not Elvis Costello? No. No, no, I'm thinking of Elvis Presley. Never mind. I'm feeling really old right now, just by no, the way. Don't, don't. <laughs> I'm just really young. I'm not that young. But. I like your Lucky Charms t-shirt. Thank you. It's wear your favorite color day. So I've got green here. Oh, is green your favorite color? Yes. Okay. And I even got green camo pants. Look at you. What's everybody else's favorite color? Um, Jake is wearing yellow. Uh, ben is wearing blue. Daisha's wearing pink. Jake's favorite color is yellow? Yes. Hmm. Are you kind of feeling, feeling some kind of way about that? Uh, yellow would never be my favorite color, not on a list no, of 10 no. colors, probably. <laughs> yellow is my mom's favorite color, so it makes me feel, I'm like, oh, somebody else friendly likes yellow. I love green and I love blue. Right? Blue is my favorite color, though. And purple is my second favorite color. Now, have you had this? I have not. Have you had the other one? No, I haven't tried them since, they, since we've uh, started them. I know that Josh has tried them. Though. Yeah, he, I just talked about that in my yeah. video. I haven't tried them, but the, um, what is it, the brown sugar one? I've had the brown sugar by itself, like in a latte, and then I've had the oat milk in a different latte, and I'm like, by themselves, I think they're really good. Together, I feel like they do fantastic. I've just... I really like the brown sugar oat milk one. It's good. I just haven't brought myself to try it yet. It's time. I should probably try it today. It's time to take the dive. Yeah. I was going to plan on making it today, and then my brain went into, like, autopilot. And my brain it's all right there. Isn't all the launch stuff right there? Oh. He told me that the other day. That's launch stuff? Uh huh. Not that, no. <laughs> I am my mind. I'm tired. Did he forget my drink? No, he's making it right now. Is that it? That is it. I believe so. All right, thank you. Sticker. I could be wrong. Honey, okay, I can't. Right? It's. Yes, it's perfect. Jake or Josh did a Jacob did a great Jacob. job. Thank you so much. See you later. Oh. Basically, the baristas that work at Starbucks are my friends. I don't have any friends, see? So I just go to Starbucks and that's how I they're so nice. For the price of a cup of coffee, I get a friendship, too. Isn't that so nice? Okay. We're going to just go in right here. and I'm going to review this. They are always so friendly, though. Like, always, always, always so friendly. Okay. So, here it is. Wait. It doesn't seem like super shit. Oh, my Lanta! It just went everywhere. <laughs> oh, God. It's literally all over my car. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. What does it remind me of? It reminds me of an Almond Joy. Like, it tastes exactly like an Almond Joy. Because there's like something coconutty about it. <laughs> I mean, not that I don't like things that are nuts or n <laughs> family friendly. Yeah, it tastes exactly like an almond joy. I don't love it. I don't hate it either, though. Like, I mean, if if like Tanya Jean went through Starbucks and she was like, "Oh, I got you this drink by accident. Will you drink it anyway?" I would totally drink it. Like, it's okay. It's pretty good, but. Like, I have a feeling, like, this is going to sound weird, but I think this is, like, one of those... Okay, I'm not a big almond fan, okay? Like, I do, like, in all honesty, like, I do love nuts. <laughs> I do. I love glazed nuts. I love peanuts. I love nuts, okay? But I'm not a big almond fan. <laughs> so, but I like almond milk, so that can't be what I'm tasting in there. Like, this is one of those drinks. This is like, okay, a Born a, a born This Way is what I call it. So, when Born This Way by Lady Gaga came out, I didn't love it, okay? It wasn't my favorite Lady Gaga song. I love that song today, right? This is kind of like a Born This Way. Like, this, I think, by the time that I'm done with this drink today, 
I think that I'll say that I really, really like it. Like, it's not bad. The other thing that I like, I'm gonna give it a four. I'm gonna give it a four. I was waiting. I think there's a lot of people that will really, really like this drink. I think it's a very strong espresso drink. You can definitely taste the strong espresso in it. You can definitely take the taste the chocolate in it. It's very chocolatey. But it tastes like an Almond Joy. That's like the first thing I thought of. And maybe that was why at first I was kind of like, I don't like this. But I have to tell you, the more I drink it, the more I like it. This is kind of like an after dinner coffee without the liquor, you know what I mean? The liqueur in it. That's what it kind of reminds me of. Um, but it's good. I really like that. I mean, they're so expensive, but I really like that they're low calorie drinks, even though they have like, you know, the almond milk in it. And maybe that's what they're trying to do, you know? Chocolate almond drink that's like not super high in calories or whatever. I'm gonna give it a four. It's growing on me. <laughs> Should I say it? <laughs> it's a grower, not a shower. <laughs> okay, I have to go now. I love you guys. I'm giving this, I'm gonna give it a 4.2. It's like growing on me. <laughs> I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.